Kwa wageni hapa uh, Nathaniel Monyeki yuko hapa ndiye mshindi wa mashindano ya Youth Chess Africa ikiwa ni mashindano ya Afrika ya chipukizi wa kitengo cha wachezaji wasizidi umri miaka nane Dadake mwaka jana alishinda kitengo hicho. Sasa yeye ndiye bingwa kitengo hicho. Ameshinda mara tatu mwaka 2021, mwaka 2022, mwaka 2023 mashindano ya hapa nyumbani. Huyo ni bingwa mara tatu. Pia ni bingwa wa kitengo cha wachezaji wasizidi umri wa miaka tisa Vile vile kocha wake Tom Amwai ametoa mabingwa mara mbili mfululizo wa Afrika katika mashindano ya chess. Tom Amwai huyo. Vile vile ni kocha wa klabu cha Chess na Saratanju Kipenda cha Mavens na amekuwa ni kocha ambaye ni kocha mkuu wa klabu hicho na amesaidia kina Nathan, Nathan hapa Nathaniel pamoja na na, na dadake Wini. Haya upande wa mwisho pale ninaye mamake <laughs> mamake uh, Nathaniel hapa na ambaye pia ni Felista Mochoki mm. babake anaweza kuja lakini hapo hapo hapa karibu haja ina mbali. Haya tuanze na Nathaniel sasa. Nathaniel, yes. kwa jambo. Si jambo. Mashinani alikuwaje? It was it was good it was hard mm -hmm. I learned there was some places where I made some mistakes but my opponent didn't see mm -hmm. I calculated it was it was hard games especially on the sixth round when I was playing an Egyptian mm -hmm. I played the Egyptians they were really tough mm -hmm. especially for the sixth round I managed to win then I continued the rest with a win I managed to beat the last Egyptian How does it feel to be the first player to win all nine games? Nine out of nine It feels good at the same time it was hard so you need to you just need to focus so that you can be able to get that the African title and you also need you also need to believe in yourself you are an African title, uh, you are African champion, a national champion, Kenyan champion, an African champion. How does that feel? It feels good. <laughs> it, it's, it's hard work to, to reach that point. It takes hard work, right? Great. Coach Tom Amwai, how do you say But to you who is going to win the Bingo of Africa, when I say I'm a coach, I'm a fan of the Bingo of Africa, i ya kuwakuza wachezaji wa Saratanji. Uh, kwanza acha tushukuru Mungu kwa sababu bila Mwenyezi Mungu hatuwezi kupata uh, haya matokeo. Na pia uh, mwaka huu mm -hmm. e, mashindano yamekuwa magumu kidogo mm -hmm. kwa sababu huu uh, uh, mchezo ume uli uli hostiwa huko Egypt mm -hmm. na huko most of the Egyptians napata uh, in chess, they have a very uh, strong, uh, I think, w uh, work regime, mm -hmm. and uh, they are tough. They are tough. Mm. Mm. They are tough. Mm. So. Hi, Felista. Na ya kwa kwa sasa. Wajua huu ni mwaka wapili. Mwaka jana alikuwa wini. Mwaka huu ni Nathaniel. Kama mzazi, unaisije. Nani unaisije kama watutu wako na shinda tu? Unaenda <laughs> unashinda hapa nchini Kenya ni washindi tu. Nasikia mm. raha, raha kabisa. Yaani unajua si rahisi. Mm -hmm. eh? So uh, to raise up two champions one after the other mm -hmm. is not easy. But at the end of the day tukishaona um, eh, matokeo ambayo yameshatendeka ya mm -hmm. tuna furaha zaidi. Na tunatarajia kwamba labda wakizidi waki, ku, ku uh, kujitayarisha mm -hmm. kwa ma, ma shindano ambayo yanakuja hapo mbele tutazidi kupata matokeo mazuri mm -hmm. ndio what pushes you so far like what pushes you to keep working hard what uh, motivates you I, it's just mm, i just keep playing as i continue playing mm -hmm. it gives me more motivation and at the same time i also work i'm also working hard mm -hmm. And I'm also looking forward to be the to be the African champion again in under ten. Wow, coach, kuafunza tu tuadogo kama hawa kazi ngumu sana. Nitaji nitaji moyo nitaji kujituma nitaji uwaelewe manake mara nini watafanya makosa kila wakati. Hmm. Ina kuaje? Ah, okay. Ile ne okay. The advantage in konayo ni ama ama teacher by profession. Mm -hmm. So. 
uh, it's not just about kufundisha chess, mm -hmm. lazima you teach them uh, good habits. Mm. And uh, some of these good habits is make sure that, uh, first of all, they create interest in the sport. Mm -hmm. mm. Akiwa na interest, de untamweka kwa ile ni kama autopilot, anajiskuma. Mm -hmm. mm, na endo ufanya hivi, atenda kufanya. Mm -hmm. mm, kama, eh, they, they know what to do actually. Kama ni assignments watafanya, they'll, they'll be the first ones to complete. Mm -hmm. We'll go through them. They play games, we analyze. We just help them. Uh, uh. Felista, ni ulize tu. Wewe unajua kucheta chess? Uh, si, si ya mashindano. <laughs> <laughs> Lakini hasa unajua sheria, unajua vile pieces zina move. Kwa hiyo siwezi angalia game alafu niishindwe kuelewa ni nini inaendelea. Mm -hmm. So wakati ambapo wanamaliza kucheza tunaweza angalia lakini ikifika technical sana <laughs> na mrusha kwa coach. Sasa <laughs> <laughs> niulize mkiwa kwa nyumba huwa mnazungumza lugha gani ile ambayo kidogo na manake huyu na dadake wanacheza chess. Mm -hmm adhani babake pia anajua yeah. sasa wewe pia unajua sasa kazi yenu chess tuko nyuma eh hey, ile ni nyumba ya chess eh hey, hata ukija carpet yenyewe ni chess <laughs> hebo <laughs> eh ni, ni kitu ambayo yenye wamezoea na ni kitu ambayo wamekuwa kicheza na huwa na train kila siku mm -hmm. kwa hivyo it's difficult kusema ati utatoroka ati kujua chess ni, ni nini ama mm -hmm. inachezwa vipi hata ndugu yao nini mdogo alisema mm -hmm. uh, ikiwa kuna competition ambayo ina, inakuja hata yeye anataka kujua atakujua ili aungane uh, uh, nao <laughs> kama mama mzazi mm. ni kitu gani kinakupa msukumo kuwasaidia hawa mm. uh, kwanza naweza sema hivi huwa nasikia na passion zaidi kuona kwamba talent za mtoto zime zimetoka zimeonekana mm -hmm. na tumezi develop so once wali establish kwamba wanapenda chess mm -hmm. we will do anything to make mm -hmm. sure that they've developed that talent they've gone the extra mile Na, na, na kila wakati nitasema si rahisi mm -hmm. sababu huwa ina take time it takes a lot of resources money eh, kila stage una move kwa hivyo ni raha kuona kwamba they are growing and they are developing in their sport and we'll take it to the highest level oh great uh, nathaniel back to you what are the challenges that you face as a player uh, the challenges i face as a player is the opponents of playing because every round that you play when you're in the tournament it starts to get harder and harder because at the same time you're getting different opponents with different ratings maybe they have lower ratings mm -hmm. they have higher ratings and you just need to play your best and maybe maybe you can push for a win and if you have if you if you like you have a very big advantage maybe you can try to look for a draw and then so that you don't lose that half point wow you are now a candidate master candidate right <sighs> that feels great eh? you're going higher all the time and the ladder is a little bit somehow higher but you're going there still that's good coach inahitaji passion sana ku 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 build confidence ya watoto kama hawa kujenga uh, ile tunaita confidence ya wao watoto wadogo kujenga kutoka kiwa wadogo ile anapocheza pale nje wasiogope kama huyu amekwenda pale nje umesikia anacheza na waarabu na akawashinda inahitaji nini coach uh, first of all uh, lazima uweke in a way you have to keep on motivating them tell them this is possible mm -hmm. uh, whatever player you're going to meet ni players wote wa mm -hmm. kawaida. So first lazima wa prepare and uh, they have to do lessons, they have to play games, they have to do puzzles and it requires a lot of time. Mm -hmm. Na pia eh, as a coach you need to be have patience. Mm -hmm. eh, Kuna patient na usiwa okay usiwa harakisha ile sana. Mm -hmm. eh, kuna ile pace eh, most of the players wako na different pace. Mm. Uh, so lazima we understand yeah. every player because what kind needs different wachezaji kama wa changa mm. uh, pressure ya mchezo shinikizo la mchezo mm. huwa ninawaathiri ki psychology yeah hiyo inashughulikiaje kwa kisha uh, kwamba wanatulia kwa kisha kwamba wanapoingia kwenye mchezo hawaingii wakiwa tayari wametetezika kiakili mm. so sometimes uh, ile kitu ufanya before a particular game uh, akijua anaenda kucheza na ule mm -hmm tunaangalia hiyo game tunaona zile mistakes wana make mm -hmm. 
Eh, so wakiona hao oh, eh, wana make mistakes kama hivyo wewe ungekuwa hivi ungecheza aje. Mm -hmm. So wanakuwa na eh, wanakuwa na hiyo confidence, confidence. ya kuface because acha muona bila anacheza mm -hmm. na pia muona the kind of mistakes wana make mm -hmm. yeah, because usipoonyesha hivyo wanaona ni kama our ni mm -hmm. wana eh, they are coming from a different world mm -hmm. they are better than us yeah. you know, eh, they, some some of them they don't believe the those egyptians make mistakes yeah mm. Philister, back to you now how not to adogo wanasoma shule wanakwenda skule kila siku wanarejea mm -hmm. nyumbani jioni uh, kila weekend ndio watafuta muda wa kuwapeleka wakacheze labda unawasaidaje una, una kwa balance between school ama education na mchezo wa chess ai huwa naiangalia uh, hivi kwamba kila sehemu ya maisha yao ni muhimu mm -hmm. na uwezi sema ti shule peke yake ndio muhimu uh, chess peke yake ndio muhimu ama mm -hmm. hata uh, vitu zingine hata sports zingine zinyonyezwa kwa wanacheza mm -hmm. ama vitu zingine ambazo wanapenda mm -hmm. sababu si chess peke yake ndio wanapenda mm -hmm. kwa hivyo ni kutafuta balance mm -hmm. ukiangalia kwa siku una 24 hours unajua ni muhimu lazima alale ni muhimu lazima asome na perform mm -hmm. na ni muhimu pia anini ya train na ashinde game zake Kwa hivyo we try to really allocate time. Mm -hmm. yeah? Kama itabidi mtu amke am mapema kushinda kawaida, basi atamka mapema kushinda kawaida. Na tuna, tunaelewana kwamba mm -hmm. ni sacrifice kwa kila mtu. Hmm? Ili ili amke mapema hata mm -hmm. mimi nimeamka mapema <laughs> <laughs> zaidi. <laughs> Kama mzazi. Eh. Ni shughuli kubwa. Sasa eh. eh, nikimalizia kwako labda kwako kwa, kwa kabisa ni kitu gani unahitaji kifanyike labda serikali ifanye kusaidia wasitu kama hawa wadogo wanapokuwa. Mm wakienda mbele mm -hmm. wao kwamba wanapata msaada wa kutosha wanapata kusaidika kabisa ili kucheza wakijua kwamba taifa lao lina wajali. Haya kuna mambo mawili naweza fikiria. Kwanza ni training eh. Mm -hmm. um, wakisha train kama vile wana train na coach coach Tom. Kuna levels ambazo lazima ulete maybe kwa makocha wengine mm -hmm. waje wamsaidie na sometimes that cost money. Sometimes they need exposure to other events within the country ama outside of the country. Mm -hmm. So kama watu wanaweza facilitate Mm -hmm. e, mambo kama hayo na ku, ku, kuzidisha ku, 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 kuleta training ambayo itawa, itawazidisha nguvu mm -hmm. kichess that would be very good alafu kuendelea kupatiana support in terms of uh, taking these children for this, for these tournaments and, yeah. and, and tournaments particularly outside because they are quite expensive so kama government inaweza saidia eh, corporates pia waje wasaidie chess chess ni game mzuri sana mm -hmm. na pia inapatia watoto exposure mzuri yeah. kwa hivyo wazidi kutu support kabisa coach uh, kwa haraka tu kwa dakika moja tu uh, ni kitu gani kifanyike kama coach mchezo wa chess ili uimarike nchini Kenya na wachezaji kama hao wapate nafasi ya kwenda mbele Okay uh, uh, the first thing ningependa ninge, ningeomba ni first of all you need to appreciate chess uh, is a very important sport in the country mm -hmm. na it has so many benefits for these juniors mm -hmm. and uh, we request sponsorship especially for tournaments because mm -hmm. uh, we have very good tournaments outside there mm -hmm. but they cost uh, a lot of money mm -hmm. and that is some of uh, our limitations okay yeah right it's finally to you now, Nathaniel. What should we expect from you going forward? What's your target going forward? Mm, to become a grandmaster at a young age and also get a higher rating. Be able to also achieve my CM title. And also to go higher, play higher tournaments, win, and get more rating as I go. You're now a champion of the under eight, right? Yeah. So next year you're going for the under nine, right? Yeah. Under ten. Mm. All right. Under ten. All the best and good luck in your endeavors as you go on to continue becoming a champion for Africa and for Kenya in the few years to come. Asante sana, Nathaniel. Asante sana, Coach Tomomai. Felicity, asante sana kwa kufanya kutengeza mdo wako kuja hapa. Kutenga mdo wako kuja hapa kwa ajili ya kuzungumzia maneno haya. Tadamaji likuwa nimekuliza suwali awali kuhusu Man United wafanya nini ili angalao wa uh, fiki katika viwango fulani. Uh, Nisome jimezenu hapa, hello ni Meshak Jeff, mimi naona nyota ya Man United ya kucheza Europe.